Joining us this morning to talk about the upcoming Oklahoma Czech Festival is this year's Oklahoma Czech Slovak Royalty. We want to talk about the festival, but first we want to give you guys a little preview of the performances you can expect. They're incredible. Take a look. Oh my gosh, that is so fun to see you guys. So much practice goes into that dancing. And with us here to talk more about the festival is Junior Queen Hannah Thomason, Prince Rex Garing, and Princess London Lippincott. Good morning, you guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for having us. Hannah, I want to start with you. Just tell us about the Czech Festival and what makes it so fun. So the Czech Festival will start at 10 a.m. on Saturday, October 7th with a parade. There's over 100 entries from um, organizations around Yukon that will include the Oklahoma Czech Slovak royalty and contestants as well as the Oklahoma Czech folk dancers. And then after the parade, we will, have, we will sing anthems at the Czech building. And all day at the Czech building, there will be dances and live polka music. And around there, there's a craft fair, food trucks. Inside, there is traditional Czech food like kielbasa and kolache. And those are always a great to have. Um, there's just tons of things. There's also a carnival. It's going to be a really great day. Oh my gosh, it sounds so incredible. London, you are holding a beautiful title and you got all look amazing. I don't know if you guys, yeah, let's get the full <laughs> screenshot of their outfits. How did you get this title? So we have a pageant, which is actually tomorrow, and we have to do an a interview with the judges, and then we have to do an on stage. Um, like we have to like talk on stage, and yes, and then then a week after, so we have to wait till a week to oh see who goodness. wins. So. Oh my gosh, well, so it's, I'm sure it's very competitive and you all are great title holders. Rex, I want to go to you. We talked a little bit about the food. What's some of your favorite food that people can enjoy when they come out to the festival? Well, they have delicious, like, the, me personally, the uh, collage are like my favorite part. They're like amazing. There's like amazing sweet bread with like, okay. Uh, filling in the middle. It's so good. Okay, so that nice. sounds amazing. Um, Hannah, and then the mm -hmm. dancing is so much fun. Do people get to dance when they come out? Yes. So okay. we have live polka music, and anyone's welcome to go polka and dance. Um, then the Oklahoma Czech folk dancers will also be performing. Um, we've worked on dances all summer, and we're ready to share them. And then um, later, there will be a royalty crowning in that same area and everyone can come watch. And then later after the royalty crowning at the historic Yukon Czech Hall, there will be a big royalty coronation ball and polka dancing there. And also at the historic Czech Hall every Saturday, if you don't get enough polkaing on Czech day, um, every Saturday at seven o'clock, there's a live band. Every Saturday, Czech Hall, come polka. <laughs> okay, I love it. Well, thank you so much, you guys. Thank you for being here. Don't forget, next Saturday, October 7th, go and check it out. I'm Jordan Ryan for Oklahoma Zone. News 9, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>